I just put two on and I like them. And guys, I've been using these same raggedy caps my whole damn life. Um, that's why they look like that because who's finna glue shit down? Like, this is not Broadway. This is not Hollywood. I'm taking this shit off every single night. I don't have time for that. Be gluing shit down. I need this shit off by tonight. Period, bitch. Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be showing y'all this new wig I got and basically like what I do to make it, you know, not look like this. But yeah, I just got this from the brand. It's called Aim. It's called Aimo. Aimunsa? Aimiosa? I don't really know. <laughs> God, so like when I looked in the box, I've never had a wig company do this, but I really appreciate that they did this. But it came with a band. I really love these because I'm, I'm the type of person, I don't like gluing my wig down. So, basically, I just measured the band from ear to ear. And I sew it onto the wig. And it keeps my wig, like, configured or stuck to my head without glue. So, I'm really happy they provided this because they're hard to find. And it also came with a wig cap. And this is a perfect color for me because this is the exact color I usually get. And it came with some beautiful lashes. Like, wow. I'm more of an extensions type of girl. That's what I have on right now. Like, they need to be, they need to feel. They don't look good right now. But, yeah, I'm more of an extensions type of girl. But those lashes are really pretty. So, if I really need some lashes one day, I definitely will wear them. Like... I haven't even done anything to it and it looks gorgeous like oh my god oh my god this is so pretty like i've been looking for a blonde kinky curly wig for a long time and like i wanted it longer than this but like i've never even seen one this beautiful that's this color like and i wanted it to be kinky curly i kept finding all these brazilian body wave body wave deep wave 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 motherfucking wave i want kink okay it's so hard to find colored kinky hair that looks good like don't look damaged it goes about this long this is about how long it is i got 20 inches and for 20 inches this is very long wow and the sides get even longer and this is um 100 human period so i know i be wearing synthetic wigs don't get it twisted, boo. Hey guys, it's Yazi, and I'm back for the part two of the wig video that I started. Um, today I'm actually styling stuff because the last time I was up here, I did not style it. So today we're gonna be styling it. So in the other video, I should have already told y'all. I should already told y'all who the wig was by and. Um, showed y'all what came in the package with my wig. Um, I got the hair from AliExpress, but the name of the package was just the vendor that I went to on AliExpress, if that makes sense. If you use AliExpress, you know what I'm talking about. But yeah, this, once again, this is the unit. Uh, um, right now, to style it, all I have is this Aunt Jackie's mousse, because even though it is kinky hair, it's still, like, on the loose side like it don't need a lot of product for real so that's the only product i'm going to be using in this video i don't recommend using a whole bunch of products unless you want that wet and wavy look which is bleh to me like i want some volume i want curls like i want it to shrink i need all that if i'm rushing it's because my boyfriend on the way i feel like every time i start recording my boyfriend on the way like is this deja vu <laughs> but yeah so, I think I already told y'all the wig was super soft. Like, oh, it's so soft. It's so pretty. It do smell a little bit chemically, but I mean, that's to be expected. All I did right here is put on my wig caps. And I put on two because, as y'all can see, like, my braids be big and bulky. So, yeah, I just put two on. And I like them. And guys, I've been using these same raggedy caps my whole damn life. Um, that's why they look like that. Because who's finna glue shit down? Like, 
This is not Broadway. This is not Hollywood. I'm taking this shit off every single night. I don't have time for that. Be gluing shit down. I need this shit off by tonight. Period, bitch. Period. My scalp need a break. Okay. Anyway, so yeah. All I do is just flop that shit on. Just like this. Boom. Put the front on. Then I'm going to take the back. Y'all can't see what I'm doing. But all I'm doing is bringing the clip down the back. Securing it on. Like this. Boom. The wig is on. You can bring it. You can make your forehead as big or small as you want it. Period. And it's already part of the middle because this when this vendor already knew what the fuck was up. He already knew I'm a middle part type of Yeah, this is how the hair looking. Like it's it's give I haven't done nothing to it and it's giving. Um, I'm kinda in a rush today, so I don't know if I'm gonna do edges. I know that sucks. I usually do edges on everything, but I don't know. Um, but right now all I'm about to do is wet it with some water a water bottle and I got my AliExpress Demon brush off brand Demon brush because who the fuck is about to pay $20 for a brush $20 or $10 is one of them prices anyway it's too damn high too high for a brush so I got this from AliExpress it was $1 it's not as great as the Demon but it worked somewhat like it for a dollar that's great so I'm gonna be going in with this brush it's not dimming. It looks like dimming, but it works. So work to dimming. Get you one. And the water. And that's it. Y'all about to just see me spraying this and brushing. Simple as it. So basically, all I'm going to do is spread a unit just like this. You want to drench it. like Because one thing about this brush is like... If the hair is even a little bit of dry, you're gonna be snagging a lot of hair off. So you wanna drench this hair. So basically right now all I'm doing is drenching it. And then I'm gonna do like a time lapse of me brushing it. So yeah, I'm gonna probably like either cut this part out or speed it up. I'm probably gonna cut it out because nobody wants to see me sit here and just spray the hair until it's drenched. So yeah, see y'all later. Okay, so my hair is drenched and I did brush a small section of it because I'm making a, why do I have a double chin? Like that shit would piss me off. <laughs> but um, I just got done brushing a small section cause I'm also making a TikTok. So yeah, all I do is like, you know, section off like this and you wanna start from the bottom. And I brush like going upward like this. And basically it just helps the ends like curl up and just clump up in a more natural way and curl itself a little bit more because right now the hair the hair isn't as curly as it could be so basically that's all i'm helping do is making it curl curl up and clump more and yeah i'm just gonna do this to the whole wig video has been gloomy oh yeah don't do the lips because I'm looking all beautiful okay so I just got done brushing it it should look something like this I could brush it some more if I wanted to but I don't really have time it looks a lot more curly, a lot more shrinkage, more natural looking. And it's gonna give me some more volume. Okay, so y'all, all I did was take some of the mousse and I just sprayed it on the hair. I'll probably show y'all a little clip. I did that part for TikTok, but I'm gonna do it on the other side too, so y'all gonna see what I did. It's not like I'm leaving y'all out. But on the TikTok, I sprayed it on my hair, but I prefer to spray it in my hand. And I'm just scrunching the hair with it and I'm flattening the top part because I like a kind of flat wavy root and then you know volume at the bottom and yeah I'm scrunching because I want it to shrink up I want it to get big 
I want that kinky look. You, you could have just wet your hair and put some gel on it after you had to wet it if you wanted like a looser wave type of look but I really want it like I wanted it to look kinky so yeah that's why mine look like this the cat is losing her mind beside me that's why y'all hear all that but yeah I'm just scrunching and putting product and the reason I'm putting product is because I don't know if it when it dry it'll just become like frizz and even though I like frizz I don't want it to just I wish I could see the cat right now because like she's acting so chaotic but um yeah I don't want it to just be pure frizz like I don't mind frizz but like I don't want it to just be a frizzy curly look I want it to be like curls but you know some frizz so yeah all I'm doing is scrunching and I'm probably gonna get my diffuser and dry it as much as I can I'm probably not gonna be able to dry it all the way and I'll show y'all what it looks like later, hopefully. It's only a little bit dry right now. It's not completely dry, but I have to go. So, yeah, it looks like this for now. And I'll come back on another day and show y'all how it looks when it's dry and bigger, hopefully. So, yeah. <laughs> 